Hey, what's up guys? I have a quick little unboxing here for you. This is the uh, Best Buy exclusive steel book here for um, Sicario Day of the Soldado, or Soldado, I believe. Um, I have not seen this film yet. This is the sequel to the 2014 film Sicario, um, which starred um, Emily Blunt and um, Benicio de Toro and um, Josh Brolin. Uh, I've heard this is actually not as good or kind of mixed. I've actually heard some people who did not like it at all. Um, but it's got mostly decent reviews. Not like not as good as the first movie. But So I actually was going to see this in the theater when it first came out. But then for whatever reason, I don't see movies in the theater very often. But I, uh, something came at the last second. I'm just dropping you know. I was going to see it, but then I didn't get a chance to. And now I, and at that point, I was just going to wait. Let's just say, just there's a movie included. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, just the usual. Movies Anywhere stuff. And this is a matte finish. There's the image I saw on the poster. That's kind of cool. Just one sticker on the top there, yeah. Get that off of there. There we go. Let's do the synopsis here real quick. I actually don't really know much about this film. In fact, maybe I... I'll just have you pause this, and you can read it if you want. I actually want to keep it as um, spoiler-free as, as possible. I like going to stuff like this blind. And there's some images. I know Emily Blunt is not in this film. Um, I've heard there's talk about bringing her back for a third if this one did well. I think this did well. I don't know off the top of my head, but... And this also happens to be an HDR, um, I mean, um, uh, 4K as well, which I'm noticing they're doing that now, which I always assumed they were going to, but they've, uh, they initially were making two copies or two versions of these films, of these uh, steel books, when they first started introducing the 4K. One regular version and then one 4K, and then um, sometime over the summer or so, or even earlier, actually, think about it, they just started releasing the um, 4K only. So anyway, let me get the uh, code out of here. Uh, it's a Sony release, and we got the... Um, Sony Rewards thing on the back. I haven't done that in forever. So here is the 4K disc. And here is the regular Blu-ray disc. Show where I put this. And the background is just some... I can't really tell. It looks like it's some dirt and stuff or not. I can't tell. It's pretty plain, but it's not blank at least. I don't see any scuffs or anything. It's black. A black matte steel books tend to um, scuff the easiest. Uh, my Chinaman, Chinaman, Jesus, Chinatown steel book that I got a long, long time ago. I feel like it's a very black. It's the the typical picture of Chinatown, and um, it's it's got scuffs all over it. Um, it's a, it's very black and very um, very scuffed up. And that's before I used to put them in cases. And so because of that steel book, I kind of started doing that because it was so easily just taking it off and out of the shelf. It got so scuffed up, but this one is, um, looks okay, actually. At least I don't think so. Is there a spine splash? I don't think so. There's some, like, gunk there. Like I said, this is a Sony uh, Pictures film. Sicario Dia de Soldado. Soldado, Soldado. What the fuck? There we go. I like the image there. I really wish I could get this, um, the steelbook for the first film, but, um, I just never got around to doing it. I think it was a, um, I don't know if it was a Zabby exclusive, but it was available on Zabby and available overseas, but I just never got around to getting it. I, I just assumed at some point they would release it at um, Best Buy or something, but so far they have not. Maybe they will in the future, but um, probably end up buying it at some point overseas. Look, here we go. Just making a mess of okay. it. Okay, let's get that straight or, or whatever, I guess. So yeah, like I said, I, did, I purposefully did not read anything about this because I wanted to uh, go in blind. I'm going to plan on watching this probably next weekend or so. Um, it is October now, so um, it's actually October 1st. Um, and I'm going to try to do 
as many uh, Halloween type films as I can this month. I don't know if I'm going to do 31 days of it, but I'm going to do as many as I can. So I might save this for the weekend or whenever I can. But uh, I'm still going to try to watch it this month. Though, so anyway, anyway, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I've got more Steelbooks coming. Lots of Halloween stuff coming related. So uh, stick around, and I've got more stuff for you. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.